Mike DeBoy represents a late night cruise. 8.29 p.m. We're going on a late night cruise, ladies and gentlemen. I like to do this from time to time. I actually just cruise around a lot for fun. Because I get bored sometimes, and I don't feel like associating with people sometimes. So I just cruise around, you know, I, I make stops places, I just drive everywhere. But right now, we're going to see how many miles you can put on my car in one hour. Um, we're going to start off, we're going to go to McDonald's, and then after that, then we'll start the timer. I'm not getting anything to eat at McDonald's, as I said. I'm just getting a Coke with no ice. I'm going to tell you why. Because I loved my 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven, everyone there loved me, and I love everyone at 7-Eleven. But... I have gift cards to McDonald's I always forget about. So, might as well use them. Stern Theology. Jonah Hill. What's up? Can I get a large Coke with no ice? Yeah, that's it. Thank you. What's up? Yeah. Thanks, you too. So, I killed both my McDonald's gift cards. Well, they actually both already killed before I got to use them. So, right now it's 840. I have 161,135 miles on my car. We're going to start just cruising. It's 840 now. At 940, we'll stop and do an odometer check and check everything out. But the rule I like to use while doing this is no highways, but uh, you can take main roads. Also at this point, I have 128 miles in my tank. So we're gonna see where we get at 940. Speaking of 7-Eleven, there's one right up there. So while bumping Will Smith, I came up with a plan. I am going to go east and north and I want to see how far I can get in an hour. And then on the, I guess I have to drive an hour back too, but whatever. So 9.40. We're just going to go east and north. Because I pictured it was easier to pick two general directions than picking, you know, just... Uh, but remember, the rule is still no highways. You cannot use highways, but main roads for sure. So... This thing, I've had it taking the batteries out a couple times, like if it's off for a while, I have to take the batteries out to turn it on. But still, for 20 bucks, you can't beat that. One question I always had, are why tattoo parlors open up so late at night? When I was going to get my ears pierced, I was going to go with this girl from work, because you have to be 18 legally to get your ears pierced. So, you have to have someone who's related to you. So... We were going to go one day after work where she lives, which was like 40 minutes away. And I don't, I didn't really mind it. But the thing is, it depends where you get it done. Because I tried to go with another friend from work to get it done. And they really didn't care. The first place did. Checked everything. They had to get notarized, so that wasn't happening. If we went to a tattoo parlor that uh, this girl from work wanted to go, it wouldn't have gone. But the thing is, she wanted to go at 11 o'clock at night. I was totally down for it, but I'm thinking to myself, why is there a tattoo parlor open at 11 o'clock? And legally, they're not, like, supposed to tattoo someone who's, like, under the influence. And who goes to a tattoo parlor at 11 o'clock at night? <laughs> this song right here. That song, Lottie Dottie, by Dougie Fresh and Slicker. That song is the most sampled song in history. In history. There's a lot of songs out there. And that is the most sampled song. Ties uh, by Biggie Smalls is a good thing with that song. Good example of how that song's uh, sampled. Current time, 9.19 p.m. Mission, heading east. In 20 minutes, gotta head back out west. Look at how fancy that McDonald's is. I should have used my gift cards there. Maybe that would have taken so many damn gift cards. 
I started this adventure at not at 8.40. Right now it's 9.34. This turned from a main road into a residential neighborhood. So I know I said I'm gonna drive till 9.40, but I'm not. I'm gonna turn around now. I don't even know where I am right now. We're gonna turn around and we're gonna stop the stop sign for a second, figure out where we are. We're gonna try to get home as fast as possible. Legally, we're gonna put on a good station. There you go. High pitch, Eric gets a job. I tried to stay on one main road the entire time. So, on the way back, I didn't get lost. So, hopefully I will. Um, I tried to do some... I tried to fill in the road. My camera kept on falling. And then it would turn off. This road is wide open. That was scary. I just ran through a puddle, and I guess I didn't realize how deep the puddle was. And my car lost control. Everything started beeping, beep, 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 and I'm like, "Oh my god!" And I didn't crash, so that's a good thing. I just passed the prettiest view. I think I'm coming up to another angle of it. Well, I did see a pretty view. Just a flip wouldn't turn on. Halfway through the journey back home. Let's do a little time lapse until the camera battery dies. These flip, this flip will eat up batteries like crazy. And it's crazy. I never thought anyone would be saying that sentence in 2016. Because when I send the date on this thing, it said 2009. My battery's about to die. That's that's a nice thing. I use this for like 20 minutes. I guess that's decent. Not really, but I guess that's okay. Just got a new battery for the flip, stopped at a gas station for them. Ten oh six forty four degrees. One hundred and eighty nine miles on my car. We got pit bulls globalization going on. I, I like the station, it's got some good DJs on it, just, uh, I'm not Spanish, so when they play the Spanish music, I don't understand what they're saying. Well, that took way quicker to get home than it did to drive there. I think I'm, like, almost home, I think. I could be wrong, it's 10.06 now. I'll see you the next check-in. Halfway home. Well, you know what? I think we're more like 20 minutes away at this point. Oh, I had my brights on this entire time. This came my bright to very dull. You can't even tell the difference. I only blinded like three old people with glasses on. This song is a good song. It has a lot of my favorite people in it. Betty Wap, who is one of my favorite rappers. Uh, and David Guetta, who is one of my favorite hash editions. It's like everything I enjoy in one song. And it's a good written song, too. She is a good singer. I like Chandelier. That was a good song. Uh, she had another song that I really wasn't too crazy about. But Chandelier, I really liked. Every time I think of Chandelier, I remember the show Chelsea Lately. And there's a video of, I, well, she performed. And since she performs with, like, her back to the audience, always has a nice choreographed thing. It's she is a good live performer only if we know like what she's hiding behind there. Chelsea had this uh, little person as, a, as her sidekick. His name is Chewy. And Chewy was actually on a chandelier in a onesie swinging back and forth. It was the funniest thing. If I pull if I can find it uh, here it is. And then if I didn't find it, you're still listening to me babble on. Ladies and gentlemen, the Camry. Her name is Cashmere. Cashmere is about to hit 161,200 miles. I'm gonna let you guys watch it for me.
And then when I go back and watch this video, I get to watch this all over again. There we go. It just said, ladies and gentlemen, at 1021. Whoop, whoop. Ladies and gentlemen, first things first, as you hear, I listened to a variety of music. Before I was listening to house music, and then the hits, and then I was listening to Deep House. Some rap was thrown in the mix. CM Fetty Wap was thrown in the mix. And now I am almost home. My car has 161,204 miles on it. It is 1027 right now. So almost an hour each way. I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video. Give this video a thumbs up and everything else. Even if you're not into the vlogs, stay subscribed for some gaming. If you're not into the gaming, stay subscribed to the barbering or the vlogs, whichever one. It's more of your type, the DVD hunting, whatever you guys want. Alright, thank you guys. See you next time.